CSI 2140 Advanced Transient set up and acquire data up to 4 channels plus phase speed information. My name is Johan van Beinbroek and in this video tutorial I will show you how to configure the CSI 2140 Machinery Health Analyzer to capture transient signals up to 4 channels plus phase. What you are seeing now in front of you is a home screen of the CSI 2140 Machinery Health Analyzer. There is a downloadable on the analyzer called Advanced Transient. So press F11 to start the transient. And the first thing that we will do is we will create a new job. How the job is working is explained in another video tutorial so I will only create a job here so F8 then F1 create new job I accept it and a new job is created so we will collect the data in a job called job 2 normally you have to go to setup acquire data to configure what and how you want to configure it however there are couple of one-time settings that we have to double check now. If you go to the old 2 page there are a few one-time settings. First of all when you go to sensor setup you can check if you're using everywhere on all your channels the right sensor. If not you can change it here so in alt 1 and alt 2 they are the four sensors. You can also check your tag. In this case I'm working with a magnetic pickup so the power is off and the trigger level is negative. There is also a dedicated video tutorial how to configure tags. I go to show RPM. The tag signal is coming in so the tag is working fine. Data display settings. Here you specify if you have a detailed waveform how many data points do you want to see and this is a list of options on the spectrum how many lines do you want to have on the spectrum the window type do you want to have uniform or hanging and the units for your four channels in the spectrum do you want to have it velocity or something different you can choose between acceleration velocity or displacement and last if you have measured a speed pulse as well do you want to see the tech lines on the spectrum yes and in plot setup you simply specify what kind of plots you want to see after collecting the data you have a maximum of four plots and I only show plot one so I click on F2 and here you can choose between you want to see waveform A spectrum A or B C or D you can have the two orbits or the full transient in this application after collecting the data I want to see the full row transient data on the four channels so my personal preference is to have the four transients active here and I prefer the format quad so I'm ready with the one time settings I can go to my settings for this particular job so I go back to alt 1 and in alt 1 I go to setup acquire data first of all I specify that I want to measure for example till 2000 Hertz and here I specify how long I want to measure for example 30 seconds those two numbers are coming in automatically if you modify the fmax and the set t sample time i don't activate peak view or demodulation for the tag i specify for the tag i specify that i want to 
work with a tag trigger on that means that data collection will only start when a tag pulse is coming in and I also want to store the tag pulses for my input I have my four sensors when I now press start to collect data he will measure the raw signal for 30 seconds in these 30 seconds I will start up a machine and I will run out a machine and the machine will go twice through his natural frequencies during the measurement you see a counter for the remaining time to collect data And what we are seeing now are the four channels transient waveforms. In a separate video tutorial I will explain the analysis tools that you have based on this screen. We are now at the end of this video tutorial. Please visit our website at www.assetweb.com-mhm for other video tutorials and product information. My name is Johan van Pijnbroek. Thank you for watching this video tutorial.